like to welcome y'all along on another adventure of mine heading out into the inside of Flamingo again, Whitewater Bay and Oyster Bay. We've got some clouds in the sky, it's a beautiful morning, light breeze blowing, I hope it doesn't get as rough as it did last time I was out here. Sun's coming up in the east, right now it's uh, about 7.30 in the morning. Appreciate y'all coming along with me. Let's see how the day unfolds. Stay tuned. I must have caught 12 to 15 with gaff top sail and hardhead catfish in this area. Moved all around, could not get away from them. While the gaff top sail catfish put on a good fight, I'd had enough. Time to move on. Well, I just caught a nice sized Jack Crevel. And unfortunately, the camera, I forgot to turn the record button on. So I lost all the fight, except for what little bit you saw on here spinning around the boat. We're going to try it again. The other cameras did not have any decent footage of the action, so all I have is a memory that I can't show you. And we got something. fish and a keeper at that. No idea what it is.
top sail cap. I had gone to this area because it had been productive for speckled trout in the past. On this day, it was only good for gaff top sail catfish. I stayed here, probably caught six or eight of them, put a few in the cooler, in addition to the ones that I had caught at the very beginning of the trip, so that we would have a mess of catfish for a nice dinner or two. As I said in the trailer earlier, they are a delicious fish to eat. Just fillet them, skin them, cook them like you would any other catfish.